Alex Deck joined by defender Andrew Gutman. Andrew, thank you for joining me today. How is life in the bubble treating you? Um, you know, it has its ups and downs. Um, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Um, so yeah, we're just kind of getting through it day by day um, and just taking it one step at a time. How are you adjusting? You have a first match at 11.30 at night and now you're prepping for one at 9 in the morning in just a couple days. Yeah, I think it's tough, um, but like I said, we're professionals um, and so we have to deal with the situation that's given to us. Obviously, COVID happening in the world uh, changed our season and our lives drastically. Um, so, you know, it's just one of those things where we have to prepare. Um, you know, these last few days we've been getting up earlier, um, you know, kind of adjusting our, our body clocks to be ready for that 9 a.m. match. How do you feel like you guys are progressing under Yopstam? You were with him for a little bit in Cincinnati and now a couple weeks down here in Orlando. Yeah, I think um, every day we've been getting better. Um, you know, it's obviously a process with a new coach coming in. It's not going to happen overnight. Um, and so, you know, every day we just focus on, you know, the things that we can do better in terms of defensive formation and then attack as well. Um, and yeah, we're just going from there. I'm, I'm liking the training session so far. I think we get better each day. Um, so yeah, I just hope that continues. Has your role changed at all under him or, or how has it developed? Um, I don't know if it's changed as much, but he's definitely emphasized me getting up and down a lot, which I, I like to do. That, right. that fits my style of play. Um, he gives me the freedom to, to do what, what I want in the attacking third and try to create chances. But then also defensively, he's really uh, honed in on you know, my defensive positioning, when, when to go, when not to go, um, when to engage the, the attacker and stuff like that. So I've been learning a lot from him. Yeah, are you, are you learning from one of the you know, best defenders in the world at one point? Do you feel like you've, you've gained insight from him in this time? Yeah, of course. I think um, any person of, of that quality and you know, that well-known name, you're going you're gonna to listen to him and you know, because he, he's been at the high level, he's played for some of the biggest clubs in the world. Um, and if he can offer any advice to me, I'm always going to listen, I'm always going to take it. Um, because like him, I want to get to the highest level I can possibly. Looking at this match against Atlanta, kicking off at 9 in the morning, um, they just played against Red Bulls, are coming off a loss. What are you anticipating from them? Yeah, I think it's going to be a, a back and forth game. You know, both of us have lost our, our first game, so we need three points this game. Um, I think both of us are going to go for it, go for the three points. Um, you know, Atlanta's a, a quality team. They have a lot of quality players, but on our side, I think we have a lot of quality players too, so I'm excited for the matchup. You were in Atlanta for the first meeting with them this season. Obviously, a very different situation in front of a crowd of 70,000 people. Um, do you think that you can take anything from that game, or is it just a completely different situation at this point? Yeah, I think you can take bits of the game, but in terms of um, you know, if it's going to be the same game or not, I think it's going to be completely different. Um, like you said, when you're playing with 70,000 people behind your back, you're going to be more motivated to push forward, to, to go into the attack. Um, and, you know, we were playing on the road, so we had to, we had to sit back and absorb that pressure. But now that there's, there's no fans, basically, I think it's going to be completely different. We're going to have more freedom to express our qualities and our system um, in this game. Thank you so much for the time, Andrew. I appreciate Thank it. You.